Hello everyone. I just wanted to make a one minute video showing how to improve the suction of an aging Dyson where the O-rings are kind of starting to get a little worn, a little, they're just not as good as day one, but the vacuum cleaner itself has no issues of any kind. I just noticed that this one here in particular, it really just starts to kind of come apart and there's just almost like a gap here and the vacuum loses quite a bit of suction. So all you gotta do is just literally get a rubber band and you're going to need some sort of poking stick, like a chopstick or something to kind of get all the way around there. But this off here. That's it. You pretty much just wrap it around the edge here. And this one O-ring that was there, it's really just, I feel like it's not the best. It really, it really aged a lot. It was all cracked up and everything. You could even just feel air kind of blowing through here if you put your hand there. That's it. I just took one rubber band. As you can see, this is why you need a little chopstick because you're going to need to get it kind of around the edge here. Once you do, when you put this back, you will require like kind of a, a bit more of a press once you get it in there. So to get this little clip in place, I'm just doing this with one hand, so I'm not going to fully close it. But when you get it in there, just give like a tighter pull because obviously this rubber band is slightly larger. But after I did this, the suction once again returned to normal. Just literally a one minute fix. I hope this helps someone. Everyone has a rubber band laying around or literally anything that you could just wrap around the top to help seal this part right here. That's it. Let me know if this helps.